Hi everyone, my name is Mariana. I'm co-founder and CEO of Biobot Analytics, and I'm completing a PhD in computational biology here at MIT. And what we do is we analyze city sewage to estimate opioid consumption. We're an MIT spin-off, and this started with the question, what can we learn from our collective gut? Can we think about sewers as our collective gut? And what can we learn about that microbiome? So as a first year PhD student, I was very excited about this idea, and I just went out and started collecting buckets of sewage from Boston. <laughs> this is me many years ago. <laughs> and you know, trying to look for influenza, trying to see how that changed during the winter season. And long story short, that project didn't work. We realized actually that it was not as easy as just going down the street and getting a bucket of sewage. We needed to think about it more from a systems perspective. And with these early learnings, we wrote a grant and we launched the Underworlds project, a multi-million dollar collaboration across MIT with a vision to transform sewers into public health observatories. And we knew that that journey would lead us into developing all sorts of new science and technology. For example, we develop software to analyze wastewater networks and understand which manhole to sample to represent particular populations. We developed hardware that would go down the sewers. You can see here our prototype Luigi in action to be able to collect wastewater in a more representative manner and collect the molecules that are dissolved in there. And we implemented a variety of lab assays to look at viruses, bacteria, chemicals, to measure things like drug consumption, antibiotic resistance, or infectious disease. More importantly, we developed partnerships with cities like Cambridge, Boston, Kuwait, and Seoul, South Korea, to be able to access sewers and develop our technology. And something we realized is that cities were actually really excited about this data. And a huge advantage of us was having the technology, but it was not enough to be a lab project. We had to become an integrated service that offered these to cities. So my co-founder, Nusha, and I founded Biobot Analytics. And now, after being incubated in the MIT ecosystem, we are fresh out of Y Combinator, and we successfully closed a seed round of financing for $2.5 million that we just announced yesterday. And that financing is going to let us expand into five cities across the US, looking at opioids in particular. We chose this application, it was a no-brainer, because it's the number one public health problem in the US right now, already being the leading cause of death for Americans under the age of 50. And the best data available to tackle the epidemic is counting how many people die. In contrast to this, we are able to measure the collective consumption of 13 different opioid drugs, including heroin and fentanyl, to inform public health action and evaluate the effectiveness of, of programming. And this data is so valuable that in only six months since creating this product, we are live in Cambridge, Massachusetts, where the city let us um, develop our technology. And we are ready to launch with our first customer, the town of Cary, North Carolina, this month. Additionally, we're talking to over 50 cities who want to implement this technology, and we'll be selecting five of them to partner this year. We charge cities a quarterly subscription fee for our service, and in the US and Canada, this represents a $1.5 billion market opportunity. And this is just a start. The same sewage that we're bringing back to our lab can be used to measure pharmaceuticals, infectious disease, antibiotic resistance, and food consumption. Data to create a health map from a city as has never been done before. As I mentioned in the beginning, I'm a PhD from MIT in computational biology. I'm of one of few experts in the world in this scientific field. You can imagine working with sewage is not very popular. And the only one bringing this technology to market. My co-founder, Nusha, is an architect. She has led teams here at MIT Sensible City Lab and the World Economic Forum 
to implement technologies in cities. We are both passionate about leveraging our skills to tackle the biggest drug crisis in American history and redefine completely how we use the wastewater infrastructure. So in summary, we're Biobot Analytics. We're the first bringing this technology to market. We're launching with our first city customer this month and expanding to five more cities this year. Thank you.